Hey guys, hello! Welcome back to another episode of Dinkum, where I'm on Montclair. We d I just finished streaming from here a couple of hours ago. I just popped back into the game, and I'm just playing a little bit. I thought, you know what? Let's go ahead and uh, record this. I realized, okay, look, one, I finally got the pathing recipe I need. <laughs> so I can finally start doing a roadway. I didn't like the way the brick bridge looked here. Oh, my poor, my poor villagers trying to get to the Tucker box. I cannot wait until we have moved. What's hilarious is they could easily go around the other side, but instead <laughs> they're going, oh, poor doggo. Sally is just like, move, doggo, move. Um, <laughs> oh gosh, now I'm going to laugh. Hold on a sec. Laugh. I meant cough from laughing. All right. I think I've composed myself, but now I've woken up my doggo. Okay, you saw on the earlier stream, I did these pawns here. I've since... Hi, Duchess. Can you just go lie down and wait, please, baby? I swear, she was fine till I hit the record button and I start talking. Um, I've gone ahead. Um, We've got the crab pots here. I then crafted a whole bunch more here. I've been going through most of my rock too, making cement for our roadway. So I've got a little ledge that goes along the inside of these because I, I missed filling one. I don't want to have to keep going with um, like the diving helmet. I don't want to have to put that on every time I go to use these. So I like to have a little walkway alongside of them. So we're going to go with that. Let's get that back down here. My mighty seed is still growing. We've got probably like seven or so more days on that. Did I feed these today? Okay, they're happy. You guys, it's not that difficult. Just follow the road. Why? Oh, it's because it's pathing, right? That's why they're doing that. So anyway, I thought I would just kind of record to show you guys what I'm doing here for this to see how this looks. Oh, sorry. This was a rough start. I should just start over, but we're not gonna. We're just, we're just going to embrace the hot mess that is a moxie recording. I don't know if I want to make it less of a ramp than that. That's a little bit steep, but I think it's okay. Well, I guess, you know, the only other option would be to make it steeper. <laughs> Duchess is just over my sitting here talking to everybody. Okay. I think that'll work. I like that look better than like a wood or the brick bridge or something. I don't think we have just a cement bridge. So this is good. I'm fine with this. Next thing I've been doing and I'm going to do is I need to make an area for um, another crab pond. Oh gosh. And I told you all I made the one. I crafted one and I'm just spawning in the others. Just, oh, I'm going to have to charge my dirt printer just to make life easier. So if I can get one more placed here, I'd be happy. I'm going to try and keep it sort of even as to what we got going on over there. I don't really care if it's not exactly the same. It wouldn't be exactly the same in nature. But, you know, I'm trying to keep things a little symmetrical. build this up a little bigger just to get you the idea and then I'm just going to repeat that same pattern of one up and then the two down in the water I should go might get my tape measure just to see how big that is oops I didn't even look to see what uh Sheila is buying today oh no I did it's an item I haven't unlocked it that I don't have yet like a popsicle or something. We Okay, so will this fit? And then I could put more crab pots on this side as well if I want it. Okay, yeah, that's just still not big enough. Let's 
compact this out a little bit. These think they're huge. They're really pretty, though. Okay, let's not break our dirt printer. And again, if when you guys are doing these, if you want to put them in water, make sure that let's put the basket on this side that you don't go more than one level deep or you will have some issues. Yeah, and then we can put this one here. Is that about how I did it? I think I have it a little more forward on this side. I think I'm, yeah, yeah, we could do it one more forward. That's fine. Um, yeah, I'm fine with the two crab pots being next to each other on it. I call them crab pots. They don't actually cut, catch crabs. Uh, that's just what you uh, use to feed them. And So then I'm going to have to, once my dirt printer is charged, we're going to build up another layer here so I can have a third one back. I think that might be all I do. I might do a couple more on the back side. I don't want to really lose the shape of this. I am trying to keep things really pretty natural. And then I am going to leave some of this deep enough for the fish to keep spawning. Some of this we're going to keep having uh, a single layer here. So I probably not this much of it, though. Let's let me shape this a little bit, because what I'm going to do, I have some seeds. I could even go get them. I have some grass seeds. Let's get our helmet on. Whoops, <laughs> there we go. I want to plant some of the rice seeds, not so much for actual harvesting and using for the cooking and stuff, but for uh, just the look of them. Gosh, it's already so late. I should have started recording this earlier, but it didn't dawn on me until like now to do it. So let me get out. Let's go to bed. Let's get some daylight, and then I'll grab some extra grass seeds. I have a scarecrow. I'm kind of tempted to just sink them down in the water to keep the birds away from stealing the rice seeds. But Fletch, why is your door open? Wow, she just left the town hall wide open. Oh, look, I got more poo. <laughs> like I swear, I've gotten two poo. One flower box. Let's see, what else was there? Um... Nothing great. <laughs> Haven't gotten anything too cool out of that yet. So let's just go to sleep. What time is it? Okay, it's 1.40. I was thinking it was later in the day than it is. I don't know why my dog is so anxious. She was outside for a very long time, too. Not that long ago. This will probably be... I didn't charge my dirt printer. This will probably be a, a, a short video anyway. Okay. But yeah, I did get, finally, I was like, woohoo, I almost hit record as soon as I got that pathing recipe. All right, let's grab our hoe and some seeds. Um, I did put the scarecrow. I, I, I think the scarecrows only do like five tiles out, I think. They don't do a huge area. So I know, unless I fence this in somehow, we are going to lose lose some of the seeds. I just oh we got a milk from that. Okay. Um, scarecrow. I got a couple more mushroom uh, lights. Spoilers. I should say spoiler before I show you guys these things. Um from doing some favors. I got some blueprints, so I got back to back. Which ones? We got like three of them during the stream. And I think I got field mushroom and yellow morel. I'm gonna need a lot, a lot more of this. I've just been standing here, well, standing here. My character's been standing. I've been sitting here in my comfy desk chair um, making cement while watching TV. I also did decide I don't want that fence I was toying with 
that I had in front of this. Um, what I'll do is... Oh, God, these crocos. I gotta fence off the other side because they just keep coming. What I'm gonna do is along the road, I think just do maybe, maybe baby, we're just gonna do a little bit of this. I'm gonna make a lot more path. I'm tempted to go down into the mines and do nothing but farm stone. I think I might line the road with that on each side. So I realized we don't need a fence if that's the case. That'll be the interior border. Okay, I'll deal with the crab pots later. Oh my god, all of these crocos, I swear. Well, this is good. We need croco meat. Do I have any cooked croco meat on me? Why? Why would you? Why? That would just be smart. So if I'm going to be fighting croc... Look, see? I thought they couldn't get out of the water if you built that up one. Where did that one... Oh, that's why. I gotta compact the uh, dirt that's on the inside there. Make that deeper. That's what I'm missing. Duh. <laughs> but I feel like it's slowly now that I've got this pathing recipe, I'm getting a little bit of an idea in my head of how I want the road at least to go around the tucker box. We're starting to take shape. Next thing you know, we'll be able to figure out where we want all the different shops to go. Oh look, and I also, I have my airport now. Today is Sunday, I could have gone. But we've got the airport. I have my bandstand, yeah, this beautiful thing. So we've got, we, we've got every building now. So that's great. Let's go teach some crocos a lesson. And also compact down that dirt. That's how they keep getting over here. This was driving me nuts. Oh, there's two of you. Shame on you. Shame on you. <laughs> how dare you just live your best little croco life <laughs> in my way. <laughs> Shame, croco. All right, I gotta pause to take my doggo out. Let me pause my game too. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> she just like flew out the back door. Baby girl just wanted to go, woo, get her some sunshine. <laughs> it's like the rest of the country's in darkness with the eclipse, but California is still sunny and bright. <laughs> okay. So let's figure out a little bit of where I die for things. I gotta really keep keep up on that. Oh, it was meat. So let's do I'm trying to face the right way. Can I do it while I'm standing under it? I can. I think I don't know that I want rice around all of it, but I think it's going to be kind of pretty to have it, especially when it's blooming. So maybe we'll put. Is it kind of weird to have a scarecrow here? So one, two, three, four. That's not going to cover all of these. I'd have to put another one back here. <laughs> I'm just going to do that for right now. We'll see. I, I'm not expecting to have full coverage. I might even get rid of the pumpkins and just for the scarecrows and not even care if we lose some of these. Because again, these are mostly going to be just for decoration. And it might actually work out to my benefit. It's like I don't even want them all that tight together. Um, it might work out to my benefit if some of them get taken away. Yeah. Well, so if we lose some of these, I'm not going to care. That's fine. Um, let's put just a few more here like maybe two there because they really are just decorative for me I'm tempted to bury a scarecrow in the ground as deep as it can go so you don't really see it but let's just let's just see how this works 
We'll see how much of it we lose. Maybe we'll get lucky and not lose a whole lot. Like, I just want a couple there. And then we'll do a couple over here. Oh, wait, jump! <laughs> She's like, I can't! The helmet's too heavy! Helmet too heavy. Oh, and for anyone who's wondering about the fish circling my head, in case you hadn't seen it, this is another spoiler. But with the uh, fish ponds, you get row. If you put row on your head, you can put it in either the head slot or the little like eyeglass slash ear slot. You get the little fishy. Uh, chat taught me about that during this morning's stream. Very cute. So like these will probably get eaten. I don't know. We will we will see what happens with those. Um, I want to do some more throughout the pond just a little bit. So maybe I'll do a scarecrow a little bit deeper in. Uh, is my thing charged yet? I think it's still charging. Let's, while I'm thinking about it, take care of this over here. This is why we keep getting crocos. Hello, we forgot to take take this down. <laughs> I wondered why it wasn't doing what it was supposed to do. What's the point in building a big old wall if they got little steps on the other side of it? This is good, though. This is the first day I really have felt like between this morning's stream and now this, where I have felt like I'm finally making some progress on what it is I want to do on this island. I want to go make some more... Come on, jump. Why? 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 <laughs> there we go. Plus, I got the leaf glider in the mines this morning. We got a ton of rock wands. So this stuff I'm going to be filling in with some more bushes, flowers, trees, spin effects, tufts, all of that kind of stuff. Uh, let's make some more pathing. We got to figure out how our road's going to go. Do I have cement? Please tell me I have cement. A little. I'm going to be farming rock like crazy. I'm probably just going to do some regular mine runs off camera where I just go down and get like copper and iron. Tin, I think we're okay. I'll get some of that. But also just lots of rock for all of the stone. Look, because look how much stone and cement we're going to need. I mean, it only takes, it takes a total of two stones to make the cobblestone road. One stone and one bag of cement. But I'm going to be going through a ton of it. So let's go see what this will look like here. Let's take that off now. I've got to figure out how I want the road to turn. I don't even know how to do the turns. I have not been paying attention to what y'all do on your islands with your roads. So we'll have it go like this. And then, okay, we'll go a little bit straighter here. Where do we want to start our turn? We'll go... Oh, it's raining again. Lovely. Actually, what's nice too, like a little spot like this, we could put a little bus stop or something here. Okay, that's going to be too soon to start that turn. This would be... Let's see how... This would be... Actually, it could come in. Actually, this could even go right up to there. That would be alright. So we don't want that to be too huge. So yeah, let's do the turn there. Figure it out. I just am loving this weather we're having. The dynamic weather that was added with the summer sun update. So good. Yeah, we, this'll, this'll be fine. And then go one, three. I think that's right and then just do this and I'm probably gonna have to move okay this will work I've been pushing slowly pushing like <coughs> excuse me all of the land
pardon me, out of the way. Um, had to mute my microphone for a minute. I'm my cough. And it's not even for my allergies. It's just like, I don't, well, a little bit my allergies, but also I just, I choked on air, y'all. Don't ask. See, John, we're going to have pathing down here for you now, bud. So I think this is what our road is going to look like. Just a basic road. Going along, doing its little roady things. Living its best little road life. <laughs> is that what you're waiting for? Some other pathing so you knew where to go, John? I just realized that's why they all keep coming here to walk on this. They think I'm a crazy lady who expects them to use this as a sidewalk. So it's a me problem, not a Dinkum NPC problem. I think that's going to be good. And I like just having the little bridge uh, going up over here. We will have to craft lights and stuff to go around it. I wouldn't mind getting another Thunder Egg. Oh, there is an Opal, by the way, that spawned near my house. I keep seeing it, but I haven't done anything with it yet. So let's keep going. I think I left just enough room for this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be fine. It's going to have more of that natural look. I'm going to plant grass seed all along there. Um, let's get cement so I can make a little bit more. All right, I'm going to pause for a bit. Make some cement. And I will see you on the other side of that. This is so time consuming. <laughs> Let's just get a little bit more made. I'll do more later. Okay, my dirt printer is ready. Let's charge our compactor. Um, what I want to do is go. Um, we need whoopsies need some ideas. I want to go in front of the Tucker box. Let's lay out the road there before we do anything else too. So I can come, you know, I can do the whole circling around without you guys watching all of that. You don't need to see it. That'll help me figure out maybe what size parking lot. I might not even do a really fancy parking lot. Oh, and that was another idea I had. Um, you know how like some parking lots you have that little I don't know what you call it, the little cement thingy that you pull up like at the, the head of the parking lot, like where you pull in to keep you like a little bumper thing so you don't go too far in. What if we use some of those new log seats? I don't know if I've got any of those crafted, so let's, um, I think that's down here. Maybe we just do like a three spot carpet parking lot. Um, I also want to see maybe how a bus stop would look in that one area. So we could do a bus stop over here. I think that'd be kind of cute. Decorate around that. Yeah. We'll put a few of those around off our road. I'm gonna like, I think I'm liking how that's coming out. I didn't know what I wanted to do with that water. So when we got the ponds, it was like, oh, heck yeah. I'm saved. So let's do, I was using this green path thing just so I would know where I kind of wanted the road to go. See, actually, you know, you know what? We don't need a road going to this bridge because it's maybe more of a footbridge. Unless we do the parking lot. Well, I guess we could do the parking lot at the Tucker box. I hadn't originally thought of that, but we could. I was thinking like these could be for where to pull up your car to park. Did I grab that other pathing? No, of course not. So maybe we do that. I don't do it where I was going to. I know I'd gone back and forth on that, so let's see.
See, why are the lines going that way? That is so freaking obnoxious. Why? Okay, so maybe we don't use that pathing path at all. And we just use the regular. I'm just so annoyed by that. Like, what if we, or we could put it in between these? That's, that's only four wide. Um, hold on. What happens if I did this? What if I put it between these? Will it go the right direction? Okay, that kind of works. And then did it. That's kind of lame. Not a fan. Or maybe we do just two narrow parking spots. Could have sworn I used this pathing on my other island and it worked for parking space. I almost want to pull in, pull in. Switch over and look over at Arwick and see what's going on. But I do kind of like using that, except I forgot to put the path down. Hello. Oh, shoot. I don't have... Yeah, I do. Um, I feel like I need to make these wider or something. Hmm. What happens if I do this? Let's just, just, just humor me for a bit here and while we, while we play. Okay, that's why it has to have that line in the middle to go straight. Hmm. Okay, yeah, it doesn't look good there. So I wish it were just, yeah, I, I don't know what I'm wishing. I, I think I need to just go get more of this pathing made and use just only that. The lines just aren't working out like I had wanted them to. They never do. I bet I didn't use it after all on Arwick. I probably did only use the uh, cobblestone. Okay, let's make some more. I'm gonna be busy. I'm gonna be busy. I also got the hardwood pergola that I needed. So we're gonna be quite busy. I can finally now use that for designing my Oakland Hills house when I'm ready. My Montclair house. Uh, I want to use that pergola as like an outdoor decking. Can we set items on that? I don't know that we can place items on top of it. Can I make one? Where is it? Actually, I think I have one crafted, but just a different material. Nope. Because what I want to do is I'll have my hillside house, but then have it come out level with the pergola like as my little deck. Can I place? Yeah, these you can't place an item on or below them, which I knew I couldn't do below. That's OK. It's still going to be pretty. And maybe I use some of the hardwood benches. I don't think I have that recipe yet, but if I do or once I do, I will be able to put the benches alongside the pergola for planters and things like that. It's making sense in my head. Oh, you guys, come on. Just, I really got to finish. This is going to be my project for the rest of the day, is finishing off the sidewalk so they stop getting trapped over there like that. Poor, poor, poor little villagers. I 
and then one there. Neat. Not a fan. Um, I think I just want it. I think it's just that's going to be the parking spaces. That's so narrow. Oh, great. Picked up that. And then just do two on the other side, or could do one wider one. Unless we move this. No, because that's... That just takes up one square. It looks more like one and a half, though, right? That's like one and a half? There aren't any halves in the game. No, it's two. Okay, so that takes two. So I couldn't do a three by. I wouldn't be able to center it. Look at you guys. You made it. Good job. So I'll have to figure out how I want to do the parking lot. That we're still a little iffy on. So then this is all going to get replaced. With this. This is my little crossroad. We need traffic lights. <laughs> I'm going to have to look. You know what? I kind of want to sleep and go look at what I did over on Arwick for my little parking lot over there and grab a screenshot just to help me over here. Oh, she's buying cooked prime meat. Um, Yeah, let's do it. I think you guys have a good enough idea to see where I'm going with this whole road situation. That's about all I'm going to be doing between now and the next either stream or video. Let's go to sleep. Okay, that's done. Let's charge chainsaw. And we'll switch on over to Montclair or to Arwick. <laughs> I'm still going to be dressed for the scavenger hunt I did with uh, Spec Bites and uh, Ryan Nora and a whole bunch of fun people. I want to see how our rice is looking over here. It'll just be little tiny shoots. Also, I need to pay attention to how many fish. I still only have three of those. Yeah, that's right. You need 15 row before they'll reproduce. So we do have our rice growing up around there. That's going to look cute. And I think then one more fish pond over here to balance out what we've got going over there. And I'm going to leave more of it natural for fishing, like I said I would. Um, let's quickly switch, switch islands. So I, I need to look at what I did over in Arwick, where I've got a little parking lot. It's so creepy. We got the mascot thing on. Oh, I probably have nothing in my inventory either because I had to do the scavenger hunt. I had to take nothing. And I'm sorry. I know I'm rambling a lot. I'm just thinking out loud and it's helping me process. <laughs> yeah. I don't even have a glider, do I? Yikes. Oh, yes. All those yummy crab pots. Nice. I can't wait to finish this little area over here. Obviously, I know I still haven't finished it because we need a lot more bushes and grasses and flowers. But putting some of those ponds, can you imagine tucking some of the, <coughs> excuse me, fish ponds around there? I'll need to finish this pathing. Now, I don't know if I want to keep using the tables like I did here for a little bridge or if maybe I'll fill it in with dirt and just use the hardwood pathing and then we'll just have it cut on over and then go to this gate here. You're all y'all. I kind of need your thoughts, you guys. Hold on. OK, sorry, I had to check on my dots. They're fine. I love this house build that Jersey surprised me with and did. It's beautiful. I just I need to know your thoughts and if you feel like this fits Arwick. I feel like maybe it doesn't fit the island very well. I know I want to redo all of the flowers and the trees like I have in the town square here. I feel like a lot of this is too busy and it was like really fun learning the tricks of like burying the trees down below. I'm going to clean this up. 
I'm going to change the way those look. I just haven't gotten to it yet. I wanted, when we had talked about a house, I wanted to do a, just kind of a simple beach house. I wanted to do this more of a beachy vibe. Something that would kind of go along. Although I think I did this after the house build. I wanted to a really, I was going to convert a lot of this to sand and do more of a beachy thing. So what are your thoughts? I, I think this is beautiful and stunning. Let me know. Leave it just a little message, a little comment on the video, what your thoughts are on this house. I This is more a Montclair vibe. Like this would look so cool. I'm going to be using a lot of these ideas that Jersey had for our Montclair build because that is going to be a hillside house. And even as he was building this, I almost wanted to say, um, could we just go do this on my other island where because it would totally go. But I kind of really want the idea of keeping this more simple and more beachy. So I would love to know your thoughts on that. And what was I going to do here? I had a thought and now I've already forgotten what this was going to be. We still have to decorate the airport. We haven't done that yet. Uh, anyway, let's just go see what my little parking lot looks like over here. Oh, I wish I could take so many of these resources back over to my other island. Maybe I will have Tom log in later and help me mule some stuff over. All right, that's how I did it. Yeah, that'll work. Hold on, let's print screen this. Okay. Oh, I wish I could take my ute over. I might spawn in a ute. Do I have any tools? No. I think that is only, yeah. How wide is that? One, two. So it does need like a three wide slot. Okay. Let's go back over to, to, uh, Arwick. I'm pulling up my screenshot so I can look at that while I'm doing this over here. Cause that, that looked fine. And then we'll wrap this up. I just needed to see. Because we could leave a thinner spot on the end. I don't know if I want it on both sides. Actually, could even do the parking lot opposite of where I was doing it. Okay. So did I pull? Let's put this, pull this back out. Okay. Hold on, Epic Games, I don't care about a game update for Valorant. Let's close that, thank you. Put this up in here. Um, oh, I have more of that, I'm gonna need that. Okay, let's, let's try this again. My perfectly mowed grass. I knew when I laid this grass down that I would be ripping some of it up to do stuff like this. So we want to make this, see, I could actually do it on, that's too tight a turn. Or the other option is, like I was thinking, maybe the parking lot is over here. Like maybe we do, and then this is where people can turn in to use the parking lot and then walk across the bridge. Let's pull this pathing up. I, oh, okay, Sheila, we will leave that for you there until you're ready to get up. And I'll just regrass this. That way, this could all be picnic tables, trees, and flowers and the like. No, you, don't worry, Sheila, you're fine. <laughs> I tried to pick it up anyway. Must be empty. Okay. What do I need... So three wide turn into here. Not exactly sure then. Because my other one didn't have like a little pathway leading to it. I think this will work better. And do we have a sidewalk for people? I don't, do we need? Yeah, do that, and then... No, it's okay, Sheila, you keep you keep sitting. I see that we've got a heat wave going on. 
Then we do three rows. This won't center on it though. Is that gonna bug me? Maybe we don't do that. We don't have to use that. Um, yeah, that doesn't look so cute then, does it? Okay, we'll do something else. Unless I do two. It works if I do two. It would work if I did four, but I think that's a bit wide. And we just do that on this side and then we go and that actually works out then before it turns over there so that kind of works and then maybe even here then here we could put a light and then we start doing our trees and bushes and things and then do the same thing on this side do I want parking spaces on both sides? And then we can get rid of all of this. Oh, I need food. I don't even have to get rid of this right now. It's just, I don't want to look at it. Oop, it was placeholder stuff. So I'll replace the grass and mow it at Sheila's. Let me just get rid of one more row. I'll keep that other just so it's fine. Oh, I'm so glad we've got this rest of this pathing. Path okay, we're almost out of it though. And then we just turn into the parking lot over here. <laughs> gotta go make more. Don't you dare. <laughs> I wish I could deconstruct stuff I've crafted, like deconstruct some of this cobblestone road lines and just melt it down into the resources so I can make just some more cobblestone road. Oh, we're gonna need so much of it. So, so much. If I wanted to, I could still make, instead of using the gum log seats for like a little stop for where to, you know, park, I could just do some little cement squares or something. I think it's good. Oh no, I don't need to because it goes right up to that cement. This one might not be as long as the other side, and it's okay. I could change it so that it matches. Not going to worry about it right now. I might, I might come change that so it matches. So then we have that and then we finish. I'm still, I'm out of cement. I know I need to make more roadway. I think that works. You know what? I might actually make this one wider uh, just for turning into the parking spaces. I think that would make more sense. So I'm going to do that next. We'll go craft some more of that. I will fill in, make that four wide. Uh, on both sides. Oh, I feel like we're finally making some progress though, y'all. Finally. We're getting there. I think this is a good place to end it. Um, the only last thing I'll say is then just to remind y'all then this is where the main part of the town is going to go. Is all this direction. This way. So all of the shops and everything that are behind the Tucker box are actually going to be moved to the front of it. <laughs> and spread out a little bit around the map. So you guys, thank you so much for watching this series, putting up with my just indecisions and 
just unknowns and not knowing how to get going or started. I'm finally now feeling like we're going to get it figured out. So also, if you haven't, please check out the Dinkum series. I started with my husband. Uh, we had our first episode go up this past Saturday, the 6th of April, I think it was. And our next episode will be coming up next Saturday. So much fun. He and I playing together <laughs> on his island called Tomfoolery. Uh, hopefully if we get enough likes and comments on that, he's going to want to keep going with that series. I think he really enjoyed playing along, uh, playing it along with me as much as I did. By the way, I'm going to, I just realized I need to build up alongside this bridge and do the cement path alongside of that. Uh, so I'm going to do that right now. As soon as I finish this episode, which is, which is now it's finished. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I know I'm so rambly. It's just I have so many thoughts in my head and I got to get them down in game before I forget them. So anyway, you guys, we will see you all very soon. Take care. Bye bye. <laughs>